literally is to collapse the country. The most poor, no jobs, no school, multiple kids, women just showing up to go directly on the welfare roll and to vote 100% Democratic. And the Republican leadership's going along with it because they want to defeat the Tea Party. They want to balkanize and break the country up. Were we able to get a better mic? All right, well, we'll have to go back to that one if... Uh, if it doesn't have, maybe it broke. I don't know. Uh, but uh, maybe we can get them to go down by the Border Patrol checkpoint itself or tell us why they they moved from that position to where they're at. Uh, maybe get into an area where there's not a bunch of wind so we can talk to them. Uh, but uh, again, ladies and gentlemen, reporting for Infowars.com uh, from the border. I mean, listen, they say it's racist if you point out that totally undocumented illegals carry diseases. I mean, have you been to South America, Central America? Doctors warn of looming health crisis due to flood of young illegal immigrants. Well, that's what it's supposed to do is bankrupt the country. What do you think Obamacare is? What do you think Cloward and Piven is? What do you think Agenda 21 is? What do you think shutting down the power plants is? This is the reality. New sensors will scoop up big data on Chicago. Metal fixtures going up uh, will grab every, that look like pieces of sculpture, but they'll provide big step forward. The Chicago understands itself, observing the city's people and surroundings. Inside of the sculptures uh, will be uh, quote data collection sensors, and, and, and see they call it a air quality, light intensity, sound volume. That's microphones. See, they're not putting up light poles that have microphones that listen to you. It's a sound volume or gunshot detector, though it's used to listen to you, see? I mean, this is 1984. It's not Chicago's putting up Homeland Security-funded systems that have cell towers hidden in them. We, you know, we broke this a few months ago in Seattle to steal all your data, and it turns out it's illegal, so they had to stop. No, 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 in Chicago, it's a sculpture. You're not against art, are you? New sensors will scoop up big data on Chicago. The sensors will also count people by measuring wireless signals on mobile devices. This was put in eight years ago, first in England, now in other cities in the U.S. last year and this year. And it tracks everything you do in real time, bypassing even the telecoms, paying to get the data from them. It, it just government's going to grab the data from you itself, but also have its own network. But it's in a sculpture. Yeah, I mean, come on. And people, people still keep making jokes about me covering the New York Times years ago about the new light bulbs can have wireless systems put into them that flicker data to communicate with new sensors that come in computer pads or that are inside the computer that then lets the government remote access your computer. I mean, that's New York Times, and it's a big liberal thing making fun of me that he thinks the light bulbs are spying on you. Okay, we've got the crew back, guys. What was it you said that was a dangerous area you were in, and, and so you guys had to move before coming on? What happened there, and what else has been unfolding, Kit? We took a, a back road just south of the highway and looked for a place near the border fence to make our shoot. And there was, we passed by a, a police station, like a little small town police station, which just so happens to have one of those uh, surveillance uh, towers. And we looked at it, I was like, wow, what is that? What? Why is that out here? So we kept driving and it's just wide open fences, no border patrol whatsoever it's just it gives you a really eerie uncomfortable feeling it's all just brush land like just about anybody can hide anywhere out there now we've got a report you filed i thought it was coming you guys did such a great job shooting this it's already done we're going to premiere it here coming up in the next segment and keep you some into overdrive kit daniels and rob jacobson are reporting from the texas border but in this new video uh and i think we're going to title it uh I guess border wide open, border patrol stands down or border patrol leaves gates open. I guess we already have the video of that we're about to show folks when we come back from break. Describe what else you've seen, Kit. It just it just hit me like a ton of bricks. The state troopers and the small town cops here are trying to are doing a better job at border security and what the border patrol can do. That's why we just saw a city surveillance tower right near the border. Like driving up here, we saw like two or three uh, 
like two or three state troopers parked several, like just every so often down the highway. The state of Texas and the local police are having to step in to protect the borders. That and let's be clear. Just like in Mexico, the government wouldn't do its job and disarm the people, so the crime rate exploded. Citizens got guns illegally, restored order. Just like the feds are stepping back, that's a major important angle right there to confirm and then do a report on when you guys get back, because I know you're coming back tonight, is the fact that Texas uh, steps in when Border Patrol stands down uh, because uh, you say you've seen almost no Border Patrol, and I've been down there, it's usually crawling, so now you're seeing state police and locals having to step in. And I want to emphasize that the Border Patrol agent that we did see, he was just on the uh, on the shoulder of Highway 281 and is likely probably taking a phone call. It wasn't like we saw him out in the Badlands that we just drove through. Oh, this is amazing. I, I've got your special report coming up. We're going to come back to you. Kit Daniels from the border, Infowars.com. I'm Alex Jones, and we're going to come back and play this report. Stay with us. It seems that everywhere you turn to these days, people are talking about the health benefits of silver. But don't be fooled into believing all silver is the same. Only one silver solution has been clinically shown to be hundreds of times stronger than colloidal or ionic silver. That's supernatural silver. It can be used internally as a powerful immune system enhancer to fight off bacteria and viruses. Supernatural silver can be used topically to treat any type of wound or skin issue. It's even gentle enough to be used on the ears, eyes, and sinuses. And unlike harsh drugs and antibiotics, Supernatural Silver has no side effects. Available as a liquid or a gel that you can use every day to stay healthy and well. To experience outstanding customer service and to place your order, visit SupernaturalSilver.com. Use the promo code SILVER2014 for 20% off your entire order. Give yourself and your loved ones a fighting chance with Supernatural Silver. Only at SupernaturalSilver.com. SupernaturalSilver.com. Alex Jones here for InfoWars.com. In the month of July, we have got giant specials on everything at MadeIn1776.com. The already discounted Made in 1776 t-shirts are only 1776. We have the new belt buckles that in only two weeks of sale are very close to selling out. There's only 500 of each. We're talking about Made in America belt buckles and nickeled brass. This is more than a summer blowout special. This is a new declaration of independence but to expand the info war we're offering the equivalent of more than five months free right now when you get a membership at prisonplanet.tv for a limited time only 39.95 a year that's more than five months free off the regular price not just this july 4th weekend but the entire month of july at made in 1776.com molan labe you can take my gun from my cold dead hands a sudden change in the wind. The day grows dark as ominous clouds move in and lightning begins to carve arcs in the sky. And you realize you are not prepared. I am telling you, just yes, take, cover. take cover. The number of intense storms is increasing exponentially in the U.S. Tornadoes, hurricanes, flooding, and droughts are happening with greater magnitude and frequency. If you are choosing to rely on the government to save you... And no one's coming to help them. You could be dead wrong. The first step towards self-reliance in the face of disaster is a visit to MyPatriotSupply.com. There you'll find the absolute best prices on storable foods, non-GMO seeds, emergency water filtration devices, and so much more. All orders over $49 qualify for free shipping in the lower 48. Visit us online or call 866-229-0927. That's 866-229-0927. And speak to one of our preparedness advisors today. Remember, before it's time to survive, it's time to prepare. MyPatriotSupply.com. segment of the main transmission. We'll do some overdrive with Kit Daniels and Rob Jacobson. I also kind of want to get Rob Jacobson's take on what he's seen while he's been down there in overdrives. So perhaps we'll do that. We're going to their report that shows the Border Patrol leaving gates open now and just leaving at night. I mean, that's how wide open this is. 
This is totally insane. Before I go any further, please remember this hour was brought to you by MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex. MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex where you find their specials. Super high quality, great customer service. This is where I get my storable foods. They're trying to collapse society. You're insane if you don't have storable food. MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex. Check them out today and they're great sponsors as well. So it's a win, win, win. Great company. You get great food. Supports the broadcast. MyPatriotSupply.com. Separately, we have the best products, water filters, free stainless steel stands, 10% off with promo code water on the filtration systems, the best ones out there, ProPure with the new filters, InfoWarsStore.com. Get your water purified and support basic liberty at the same time uh, by funding this operation at InfoWarsLife.com. Got some great specials, detox specials on X2. Super hot product, but we're discounting it because we want it to get it into your hands. I want to thank you all for your support. X2 at InfoWarsStore.com or go directly to the supplement subpage at InfoWarsLife.com. We've got some new items coming this week. Made in America apparel and new Molon Labe belt buckles as well. Coming to madein1776.com. Now, ladies and gentlemen, uh, let's go ahead and go to the border report showing more evidence of a complete treasonous stand down. In the border city of Brownsville, Texas, the incredible decrease of border patrol activity emphasizes that not only is the border patrol stretched thin, but agents are also being pressured to stand down from enforcing immigration laws as the federal government also begins to enact a media blackout on America's vanishing borders. We're here at the international border in Brownsville, Texas, and as you can see, there's hardly any border patrol whatsoever, even at the border. You would think with the current flood of tens of thousands of immigrants from Central America overwhelming or border Borders, Brownsville would be crawling with Border Patrol vehicles. But on the extreme contrary, we saw no exaggeration. Well over 10 times as many Border Patrol vehicles parked at various facilities and we saw driving the streets in and around Brownsville. In fact, we stood for well over an hour outside the border checkpoint in the city and only saw maybe one Border Patrol vehicle every 10 to 15 minutes drive by. Just look at this wide open border fence. It's at night and nobody's guarding it. It's wide open. This just highlights the illusion of border security by the Obama administration. Consider the fact that the surge of immigrant youth has increased from 6,500 in 2011 to 90,000 this year alone, an increase of over 1,300 percent, and it's crystal clear that the Obama administration is forcing the Border Patrol to back off of enforcing existing immigration laws. One of the very few Border Patrol agents that we observed actually patrolling South Texas took a very keen interest in us. As you can see, he speeds up to catch up to our vehicle and likely ran our plates. We tried to flag him down and talk to him, but he didn't respond. He tailed us very closely for several minutes, nearly all the way into downtown Brownsville before he finally peeled off. We were driving around the border. I guess he took an interest in us. We're standing outside a illegal immigration detention facility about 40 miles northeast of Brownsville, Texas. We drove down to the guard station and asked if we could take a tour of the facility as journalists, but they refused, told us to turn around, and even told us to stop recording. Ready. They were journalists out of Austin. Is it possible for us to take a look around? No, sir. Drive around? Okay. You will have to call in and get an appointment. There are signs. You do have one sign, not to be recorded. Okay, that's fine. Over the past few weeks, the feds have been shutting down areas immediately on the U.S. side of the border, which have traditionally been open to the public. There they are closing them down by citing safety concerns. Do not enter. Authorized personnel only. Signs like these have been popping up in the last couple of weeks on our side of the border. To keep the public and the press away and in the dark about the border collapse. This is simply a media blackout that allows the Obama administration to control the narrative on illegal immigration. They've already been doing just that by deceptively skewing the number of deportations in their favor by classifying cases where immigrants... All right, we'll be right back, folks. You are listening to GCN. Visit GCNlive.com today. You are listening to GCN. Visit GCNlive.com today. Man, when I get home from work, all Betty does is watch her reality TV and then she goes to sleep. I can take her on romantic dates, I get her flowers, you name it. She's just not the woman I married. Oh, Ralph, that's just awful. Does this seem familiar? Are the honeymoon days of your relationship long gone? If so, consider this. The abundance of chemical additives, pesticides, BPA containers, contaminated tap water, and other toxic substances found in our environment. Experts know our bodies are suffering 
suffering and being thrown off balance, especially when it comes to your natural systems. Forget synthetic chemicals. Super Female Vitality brings forward key herbs specifically chosen for women's biology without the use of phony additives. Get your bottle of Super Female Vitality today at InfoWarsLife.com, InfoWarsStore.com, or call 1-888-253-3139. InfoWarsLife.com. Live life healthy.